Hi, Tulin. Oh, Tulin's flying. <laughs> Lovely. I just wanted to give him a chance to shine. <laughs> Does Tulin have a special mask? Yeah, but I don't think we got it. I, I assume where he did has we, one. Where did we get... Tulin? No, <laughs> where did <laughs> we just, where did we get this kid? Where did he come? No, no, no. The, the other guy, Yajirobe's whatever his name is. Where did we get his mask? In his area, like near his home. What is that guy's name? Unobo. You Unobo. You so I was close with Yajirobe. Unobo. You weren't that far off. I was pretty close. He's not as memorable as Tulin. He's just not. Oh, there's sky stuff in cloud. That's horrifying. All right, trines. Link very careful not to drop his Game Boy. It's on a wire. It needs to charge. So much sky stuff over here. We did it! Hmm. 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 Mm. That's a storm. Did you see what else happened? Nope. Okay. What else happened? Pull the map. You're falling. Okay. Down? Well, down? No, no, on the D-pad. Do you see there's another fairy to the right? The bud? Yeah. Oh, that was already there. Oh, okay. Yeah, that was there. Um, okay, well, let's... What's this pin for? That's to get towards where we're going. Oh. We don't need that. There's a marker. Right? Well, it's easier to see. Let's look for... Oh, hold on. Do I want to land that? No, I don't. I don't want to... I don't want to have anything to do with that. Is there any... We're looking for shrines. We're looking for shrines. Uh... We're starting to see... Stuff... Should I land in that, or is that Oh, there's bad? a shrine. Where? To the right. Oh, yeah, I see it. Me. Go ahead and mark that. That's, like, right where we're going. It is. It's convenient. It's the one for the stable, actually. This? You don't have anything for lightning, and you're holding metal. Oh god, oh god. I thought I could get away from it. Um, 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 Any other shield? Why is this one Don't know. metal and this one's not? That's strange. Is any of the gear I'm wearing metal? Not there. No. Okay, so I'm good. Alright, it's fine. I kind of lost some of my juice there. You're fine. I'm, I'm fine. I'll be fine. All right, I'm no longer in the clouds. I'm in the, I'm in the, not clouds. So there's a shrine. Is there any other shrines? Running out of juice. Running out of juice. I really don't see any. No, neither. Where is this? The shrine's to your left, and then the stable is there. And I'm going to the stable. Yeah, but you can do the shrine so you have a warp. Mmm, that's a good plan. I know. I'm alive. And it wants me to know that there is a sh shrine nearby. Oh, it's one of the big dragon guys. Put a, a death symbol on him. Yeah, this just lets us know not to go that way. That way's bad. No reason to go over there. Maybe he's the one that makes the, th the thunderstorm. Maybe. And if you, like, kill him, you get the ability to make thunderstorms. Hi, Jelly. You know, I did not expect that to happen. I kind of did. I did not. No, get away from me. All right, now... You've made it. We've made it. Ooh, another cherry tree. 
Oh yeah, don't those like tell us where the elk are? Do you remember? They do a thing. Yeah, they tell us where the the scary yes. deer are. Maybe. Maybe they do something else. I just remember the scary deer. I think maybe they there's a secondary function to them, but I don't recall at the moment. Let's find out what the shrine is. Long or wide? Long or wide? Long or wide? There's a fountain flowing long or wide. Hmm. Hit it with a paddle. Yeah, I'm, I'm seeing that this is the spanking shrine. Okay, so I just like lift. <laughs> All right, Miyamoto, whatever you're into. Got it! Hmm, so they give us this. A box. A companion cube. So we can, like, apply great force, maybe. Because this will weight it down and, and cause it to fall, like, faster. Oh, no. Recall. No, I, I think it's going to come back on its own. All right, so now I can't make it go any... Oh, well, I kind of can. Oh, no, nope. my brilliant plan. Hmm. All right, don't worry. I've I've plan. I have plan. I'm listening. All right. Here's what I'm gonna do. This is smart. I'm gonna go through this. I need a minute. Let me go through. You can't. Why? I don't know. Oh no. Oh god. Oh god. Crouch. Crouch. Pray. Pray and pr okay. You think that's hollow? a bad idea. I don't know why that didn't work. That seems yeah. like a foolproof yeah. plan. Foolproof. Oh my god! I know what to do. I grab ball? We have a new problem. Um, oh my god. Alright. I'm so close to making this work. It's It takes too long to go. Why are you trying to get on it? I'm trying to get on top. Why? So then I can attach the cube, and I can pull it further back. What if you put the cube on the front of the paddle? What will that do? Well, I can push the ball further forward. Oh, oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Watch this, Mel. If you turn it so the point will hit the ball, I have to move the thing and then attach this at this point. Oh wait, I can't pull it back. Let go of it. So you think that might work? That might work, okay. This is very difficult because I do not know how to do it. All right, so we're gonna pull that back. Bring this back. This has now got a little extra oomph, and it has a, uh, a pointy end. And I don't understand engineering, but I think if it's pointy, it'll push it more. Hmm. 
It's not getting a full swing because it's getting stopped. I don't know how to make it go above this level. How do you do that? Like I make it square to the paddle. What? Like you had it on the back? Oh, here we go. This is how I should have done this to begin with. Oh, thank God. Okay. Yeah, this is how I wanted to do this. And now I, like, just can. There we go! Now we're cooking with gas! Alright. This... What are you doing? Come on. It can only go that far. What?! That's impossible! How is it gonna do the thing? This is how it's supposed to work! I thought this whole time. Are you kidding? What? What? Oh, come on. Are you serious? It doesn't go any higher? No, it doesn't. That's not good! You don't know what to do. Do you know what to do? Yeah, you're gonna put the cube on the face of it the same way you put the cube on the back of it. Wait, are you serious? That's the only difference? That's what I would try first. Why would it matter if the cube there. was... Click it. Why on earth would it's it... It's a little too low. But it might work? It's too low. Why would it matter if the cube was on the front or the back? Because it's going to hit first, and but then it will have continuous force through. Now lift it and try it. But it's the same amount of thing hitting. Oh, go to hell! Why does that matter? Because this is the paddle, and you have the cube here. So the cube is hitting the ball first before the paddle, instead of back here where you were trying to do the weight. Because if it's here, it has all of this to push. This cube. So you're telling me that all I gotta do is I have to attack. Okay. Let's to extend it. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So I start with that. You think that's such on the ground? Mm, maybe. Move it. No, it's not. Okay. And then we put this on it. This is the hardest shrine in the game so far. Now something happens. We get a train. You do. Here comes the train. It's gonna land right on your face. Well, I don't wanna land on me, but I... Okay, there we go. Now you need to push your train. Cause it's... Rotate, cause it's long or wide. So now it, I gotta spank it sideways. Uh huh. Oh my god. This is this is terrible. This is the worst one. All right. Ready? Go. I'm not getting that treasure chest. That I'll was that shrine. was that was awful. That everything about that was awful. I had to learn about whatever that is. Uh huh. I do not understand why it mattered what side the square was on. <laughs> I should get the fighting ones. Yeah. I should get the fighting ones and you uh -huh. should get the puzzle ones. Yeah, correct. But life isn't fair, and I get those. You're close to the stable, though. I almost forgot why we were here. Like, I've been... I've, I'm so in shape mode that I forgot that? that the reason that we were here... Oh, it's just a tent? Uh, it's a little tent. It's probably full of Yiga clan or whatever. They'll be like, oh, thank you for being here. Now we'll kill you. 
Or maybe not. They don't have the, the bad. I hope Captain Flaxel and the squad are alright. Oh hey, things are pretty dicey ahead. Captain Flaxel's monster control crew squad is executing an operation there. There's a pirate ship moored on the shore of Metanart River to the west. But never fear, the monster control crew is on their way to take them out. <laughs> Why am I not out there with them? Because I'm here to keep them fed. I'm a cook. In fact, I just threw together a new recipe while I was holding down the fort. Here, give it a try. Well, that's nice. Thank you. If you're confident in your ability to swing a sword, you should go help Captain Flaxel and the others. Head west. Okay. Anyway, we're anyway. here about a horse. We're not, well, we're not here about a horse, are we? No. We're here about a flautist. Oh, God, we did find Zacchaeus. Oh, it's the guy. Hiya! So I bet you climbed up here with me for some good reason. No, no good reason. Need something? Or hey, did you come to listen to my performance? Oh. I want to hear you play. All right, you look like you could use a smile. I sure could. So just for you, I'll put on one of my finest performances. You could save it for the fairy. Hiya again. Need something from me after all? You stable trotter? Huh? You met the stable trotters? Yeah. How yeah. do your pants glow? Wow, the troupe is touring again and they want all of us musicians back? That's great! But first I have something to do here. I can't go back to the stable trotters until I take care of it. Come on, let's move this down there where it's safer. I need to tell you what happened here. <laughs> like, <laughs> sorry, your pants are ridiculous. <laughs> you might hear about this from someone at the stable, but what happened is that there was a fire in the field. Yeah, right on this spot, this burned patch around us. There were some flowers here before. It was all my fault. An accident, but still my fault. You see, I have a friend who lives at this stable. Her name's Height. Maybe a mother? She's been asking people if she could see a glowing tree. It's just something from a picture book. You know, I, it's not real, but she really, really wishes it was. I promised her that I'd show her one. She so, make promises you can't keep, so Piper. I, I, I burn this whole damn place to the floor. <laughs> not my brightest idea, uh, given they don't exist. And then I was stuck. So I thought I'd just use a little tree and a little fire and make a glowing tree really quick. That's, that's all. Aww. That's how things got burned here. But I was only thinking of my promise to hate. Hate? Hate. <laughs> Haiti. Heidi. Besides, it didn't even work. Aww. I would still like to surprise her with a glowing tree somehow, but safely. So now I'm collecting fireflies. I only need ten more sunset fireflies, and then I'll have enough to make a whole tree glow. That will make Heidi smile. Do we do we have ten? <laughs> I'm going to use sunset fireflies. That's going to make Heidi happy. I don't think we do. Well, we don't have any. Or maybe we just must not, must not have ten yet. We have to have one, right? Yeah. Certainly we have more than zero. The deep forest to the north. But which way is north from here? Maps aren't really my specialty. My specialty is... <laughs> lighting stuff on lighting fire. Lighting stuff on fire. <laughs> Finding them isn't the hard part. I'm bad at being quiet. Okay, so the forest to the north is where you can find fireflies to get Piper to go play for the fairy so we can upgrade our pants. I need a pony point. Thanks for coming in such bad weather. Hey. Welcome to Highland Stable. Ah. Thank you for supporting the Stable Association. This is your first time here, you get a pony point. Now then, once again. Ah. Welcome. You want a horse or something? No. Ah. All right. Heard about the giant white stallion. Hadn't actually laid eyes on the white horse themselves yet. They're planning to take the road of the Lake of the Horse God north and south. You know, it's over yonder. <laughs> I can't leave my job, but I'd like to see that horse. Yeah, okay. Yeah. 
You a nomad? Suppose you've already been seeing the horses around fair and grasslands then. Well, I grew up taming those horses and I polish my riding skills till they shine. In fact, I'm sure there's nobody better than me. But these days, putting my riding skills to the test isn't enough. So being the horse enthusiast I am, I've come up with a contest guaranteed to push me even farther. That being said, I've had to put the race on hold on account of this foul weather we're having. Once the rain lets up, it's back on. So come and see if you can beat my record then. What? In in Breath of the Wild in the Farron region, wasn't it just always raining? So this is like more of that. Yeah. Ah, Link, has that empty frame caught your eye? Walk over here, son. Oh. We're putting paintings on display for everyone to enjoy. I figured it'd be a good idea to hang some big frame like that. It's sure to be a centerpiece, which means I've got the perfect painting to put in it. I was hoping that you could get some naked Gorons, just <laughs> big, big uh, stallions. I just need to get a look at the picture of that giant white stallion, then I could paint a copy and hang it on the wall. Ooh. Yes, need something at this late hour, sir? I can tell you about the area if that's what you're here. Ah. We have lots of happy horses roaming free around Highland Stables, so if you need one, you're in the right place. Happy horses. Then you can take it north or south or wherever you feel like going. East, west, up, down, whatever. <laughs> take the horse straight to hell. <laughs> I can recommend some scenic spots to visit if you'd like. Wait a minute. Can you ride a horse into the depths? Can you just take a horse and just straight into the hole? Let's get scenic. My first suggestion has to be the stable nearby. It's called Lakeside Stable. You'll find it if you take the road towards the east at the edge of Lake Floria. From there, my next suggestion's nearby. Go further east, turn south at the ocean, you'll reach a resort town. Lurland Village, it's called. Okay, we know about this. Yep, 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 yep. Like, I wouldn't take Kepi into the hole, but I would yeah. just find some random horse and ride it and just jump straight into the hole. I'm so curious if that if it'll let you do that. <laughs> the best way to meet people is to climb on their chair that they're actively sitting in. <gasps> Pirates strike at pristine ocean resort. Oof, pirates in an ocean resort. That has to be the village way down in the southeast, I think. Lurland Village has been plundered following a formidable pirate attack. Survivors are left with crushed hopes. Uh. I knew it was poor people. I hadn't thought about it before reading this article, but I guess it makes sense that pirates might attack an ocean resort. Oh, hello. Mind if I ask you about something that's been troubling my thoughts? Have you perchance seen a rather strange animal around here? Strange animal? That's right, it was a stocky animal that had a wider than a horse and had strange horns, but not like a cow or goats. Oh, and it had tusks that made the beast look like a terrible brute. I saw the animal once in the forest off to the east. I rushed closer to get a good look, but it ran off by the time I got there. I've never seen anything like it, I must say it was the whole experience was shocking. Some travelers passed through here from Lakeside Stable and said they'd seen a similar animal. So maybe I'll find it again somewhere. Are they talking about the crazy looking elk thing? Uh, maybe a Lionel? Oh, shoot. It's probably a Lionel. Have we seen a Lionel? No. That's so well. weird. We... That's weird, isn't it? That we're this far and we've never seen a Lionel. That's kind of strange. Okay. Huh. Break this. It is nice when he breaks the thing. You lit this on fire. Put it out. Blow it out. Wow does not do the thing. I want this. Thank you. A like-like. Great. He like-likes you. Oh, he can spit fun balls. Oh, got more friends down there. Your soldier too screw broke. Your, your back's about to get broken too. Tulin, or Spirit of Tulin, or whatever you are. Get him. Wish the like like would eat the guy. Yeah, me too. Ow. Oh, did Tulin hit that for you? I think he did. That was nice. Did the other guy die, or is... Yeah, I think he okay, died. Okay, but there's more guys further in. There are. Tulin, shoot it. 
<laughs> shoot him in the knee. Tulin's going to town, Tulin. Tulin. even when it doesn't make sense. You did it! And you get a some... There's another one. Yeah. It's the- that's the bow, I think, that lets you shoot things that are very far yeah. away. And, like, that's not a bad thing, but... Uh... <laughs> that man's dead. You could probably also just, like, run past this thing. I could. I mean, now you seem set- oh, there's something up in the air. Where? To the right of the like like, there's boulders that can I be see. broken. So there must be something hiding up there. Jesus! Going to town, Tulin! Thanks, Tulin. Ding, 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 ding. We like that. Did this one not give you a chest? No, it did not. Well, that's kind of sad. Um. You can. Yeah, bomb. There's a lot happening right now. There you go. You got there. Listen, there's a lot going on. Is this where the jumpy frog's gonna be, probably? Where are we? There, oh, yeah, there he is. So much for that. He's attacking you! Not anymore. Bubble Jam. Those bubbles just stick around? Flint. Okay, that's all. Is there nothing else in here? Not really. Just there, a wasn't, lizard. there wasn't anything on the other side. There wasn't like a path forward. No. No, oh, there's just that weird stone. Yeah, the glowing one. There's amber. Yeah, that is the, definitely the worst way. To break things? To break yeah. things, unfortunately. Because whenever we learned that he could break things, I was excited. I was like, oh, we won't even have to have the weapons anymore. But we do, because otherwise it just goes flying and then you have to, like, find it. Is this all from... Sorry, for a minute I, like, I forgot what we were doing. Is this all from the well? This is all from the well. This is a lot. Yeah, it is. Oh, wow. That's a lot of additional power. Like, goodness. To fuse? 50 additional power on a weapon. Yeah. Okay, I don't think there's anything else now. You can probably uppies out of here. Yeah. So the whole goal here was... Bubble fireflies. Gem. Fireflies. Fireflies. We have to get to fireflies. To progress the quest, yeah. Yeah. So you need fireflies, which are to the forest to the north? Yes. Um, but there was... Did you finish everything at the stable? That's what I'm going to go check. Because you didn't talk to Birdman. Yeah. Birdman's always at the stable. I didn't see him, but I presume that he's there. Birdman. Whew. There's Birdman. Oh. Hey there, partner. Did you head this way after hearing the rumors? Even without wings, you've traveled all the way here. That shows some serious reporter spirit. Well, let me give you the scoop. Some folks have heard a voice near here that sounds like Princess Zelda. I heard the chirps and warbles from my little birds and headed straight here, but something's fishy. 
For starters, the strange voices crowing from floral plain to the northwest, night after night after night. Leave the RMS. Leave the RMS. At least that's what I heard. I didn't get too close. Got out of there fast. Felt like a curse just blowing through on the wind. No, sir. Not gonna think about it. Anyway, all the travelers who heard the eerie voice have gotten spooked by it. They've been throwing their weapons down the well and then running away as fast as they can. Could the voice really belong to Princess Zelda? She's usually not usually so haunting. All we can do is seek out the truth, partner, even if it is a little scary. An eerie voice. Okay. So there's a voice in the well? No. They're throwing their weapons in the well. Totally fine. Just worried about you is all. Oh. What I'm saying is I think we should investigate this story together. I think we should leave at night. I'll be waiting right here. Just come and get me when night falls. Okay, well, oh. it's 7.30 in the morning. <laughs> it's 7.30 a.m. Hey, buddy. I'll see you at night. <laughs> Sit until night. Huh. Not the best weather, eh, partner? It's around the time the eerie voice has been heard on Furo Plain to the northwest. Folks say it happens night after night after night. Could it really be Princess Zelda, though? I want to really partner. Okay, we can do this, partner. Send for the feral plane to the northwest. Follow me. But I can't fly. Oh. Hey, partner, over here. Oh, I think you're going to get warped. Oh, you didn't get warped. Glow pants. You can see in the grass because of the glow pants. Leave. Ah! D did you hear that, partner? Oh, I thought that was him. That's the, that's the Zelda voice, I guess. That that's the voice, all right, and it's close by. Is it Princess Zelda, though? Might be, but but where is it coming from? My legs won't move. My wings won't flap. I'd duck out of here if I could, but I can't. You're a pelican, not a duck. So, that's Beetle. Leave the land if not do you harm. So they were throwing their weapons in here. Leave the arms, leave the arms, rip not, I'll do you harm. So it's in there. Seek the storm, seek the storm. Fear it not, you will stay warm. Huh? When did you get here? Do you need something from me? Misunderstanding. Leave the arms? What are you talking about? I wasn't singing anything remotely like that. I've never sung a song with those lyrics. Seek the storm, seek the storm. Is that maybe what you heard? Because that's what I was singing. You also heard, for if not, I'll do you harm? <laughs> Leave your arms or I'll kill you? What kind of nonsensical song is that? Fear it not, you will stay warm. Those are the lyrics I was singing, and if you put it all together, seek the storm, seek the storm, fear it not, you will stay warm. It's a song about a cute little fox who is proud of their warm fork wor worm <laughs> who's proud of their worm and they chase storms since they don't get cold. Anyway, I'm not trying to cause trouble or anything, but I don't think it's entirely my fault if people misheard things either. I just like how my voice sounds here. Prettier, more refined. Hmm. Sounded fine to me, but everyone else is hearing dire threats. Leave the arms. I guess that explains why weapons kept getting thrown in the well every morning. They could be dangerous, so I collected them all over there. I've got no interest in them, so feel free to help yourself. Aye. Hey, that you down there, partner? What's going on? Tell me everything. Misunderstanding. Oh. Out with it, partner. What'd you discover? Is Princess Zelda down there? Yep. No. <laughs> it's just someone or singing in a well. She's just practicing. Oh, I see. And her voice echoed off the well walls, making it sound like the princess's voice. Acoustics are strange. And that same distortion made the lyrics she was singing sound more like threats to everyone who heard her. 
Ah, so the mystery is solved. Now I know why I had all those goosebumps. I sensed one heck of a story coming my way. Thanks for your help, partner. Mm. We've worked together to chase six of the stories relating to Princess Zelda. Mm. You've really gotten the hang of things. You could probably get a full-time job at the paper if you wanted to. Go on and add this to your nest egg, partner. It's a hundred dollars. We got a lot of money. Now head on back to the office and write this one up. Better hurry, too. We wouldn't want more people thinking the princess was casting spells from a well. Until next time, partner. So long! Flap, 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 flap. But weapons. Are there any good weapons? Whee! Free weapons? Uh, I mean, my suspicion would be... Oh, well. Okay. Giant boomerang? I can't carry anymore. I'm sorry. You just can't. There's more stuff. Blue Lizal Reaper. Powerful attacks when you're down to your last heart. Ooh. Is that the same thing? There's one on the ground, I think. Yeah, there's one next to you. It has a question mark, but it's hard to see because you can't pick it up because you don't have any weapon slots. Just throw that in the river. It's the. It's another Reaper. Oh, I see. Eh, they're there. Take whatever you want. I don't care. There. Now I have a variety. I do not want to keep this Beautiful. one, though. Beautiful. Okay. And that is where we'll stop. We still haven't gotten the fireflies. <laughs> no. But we're closer than we've ever been to the fireflies, so we can upgrade our pants. Wonderful. Wonderful. Play. All right, so we, <laughs> some is, sometimes it's too fast, sometimes it's too slow. We didn't even get to look at the skull for that thing. <sighs> Where was the skull? To the top. Oh, well, we were running into like scaries. You we're running into scaries. Yeah, then we went over here. And you uppied. Oh yeah, we had to deal with a thing up yeah. here, which was, was very neat. I liked that. Mm -hmm. We did this this shrine. And then, and then we went back here. Yes. We flew. We were scared. We threw some stuff. Um, that was me flying. Yep. Yeah. And then I took over. And when I took over, I... fought him. There, you there go. I go. And then this is a fight. This is the fight. This is what a fight looks like. I'm making a beautiful design. Look at all the things I can do with my spirograph. <laughs> then we came over here. This is where I tried to build a thing and then I went the wrong way and I tried to Ooh. fix it. <laughs> wow. Oof. Oof. I really tried to make that work. We finally got the armor. And then we went. They were like, we need the, the flute player. Then we flew. We're flying around. To the tower. We went to the tower. Had to do underground stuff in the tower. And then we were flying again. We flew through a storm. We did a shrine. Gucci plane. <laughs> I don't think that's... That's Gucci. That's Guccini. I know. It's my favorite pasta. It's very expensive. You like it plain, though. Guccini. I like mine plain. Just butter. God, working at Carabas and the, the children always wanted butter noodles. Like, they would not eat tomato sauce. When I was a kid, I ate tomato sauce. But every child, every child was like, butter. I was like, really? Every single kid? Anyway. So where is... So we just, where are we? I don't even remember what this is. This is the Zelda voice. There we and go. And that's where we yeah. are. It's where we are. We did it. Proud of us. I'm going to save the game because I will forget. All right. <laughs>